Now to the debate about California's minimum wage. It's going up at the first of the year. Now, small business owners are wondering how they'll deal with the added cost. And it's really tricky. It's tough. It's really tough. 1550. That's what California's minimum wage is expected to be on January 1st. And when it happens, it'll be the highest minimum wage in the nation. This comes as many businesses are still recovering from the pandemic and now dealing with inflation. Yeah, KCRA 3's Lise Mitri has been talking to owners about the impact that this change could have on them. It's tough. It's really tough. Donuts and coffee opened in East Sacramento two years ago. Right in the middle of pandemic. <laughs> Owner Tana NY says they have eight employees. Including Baker. People forget that we have Baker at night. <laughs> we have two Baker at night. She says the two newest employees are making minimum wage. For small businesses like hers with 25 or fewer workers, that's $14 an hour. For bigger businesses, it's 15 The croissant bites? Yeah. Uh -huh. Do you want 6 or 12 today? But come January, minimum wage would increase to fifteen fifty across the board, a boost automatically triggered by law if inflation exceeds 7%, which is expected. We get really busy some certain day, but we can't just hire more people because then it will be costing us so much that we can't even make that. From East Sacramento to Old Sacramento. Small businesses say the change might mean higher prices for customers. Oh, I'm lucky to be in a kind of an industry where it's impulsive and people come down here and when they come down here, they're a little more relaxed. Owner Jason Minow says the Sacramento Sweets Company has already been facing rising costs for ingredients. The inflation, you know, trying to keep up with that. That's one of the biggest challenges. But he still thinks this is a sweet deal. Minnow's family-run business has been here in Old Sacramento for more than four decades. Kind of becoming part of that history. What else could you want to do? Right? Yeah. <laughs> Chokes me up. The state estimates there are about 3 million people making minimum wage here in California who would benefit from that increase. In Old Sacramento, Lizay Mitri, KCRA 3 News. And the wage hike could continue. There's a group that's backing a so-called living wage initiative that voters could decide in November. If it passes, that would eventually make California's minimum wage $18 by 2025 and will be adjusted to keep pace with the cost of living.